at this point, I mean, enough's enough. People living in the Lantana Hills neighborhood of Southwest Austin are puzzled about the signal lights here at the intersection of West William Cannon Drive and Rialto Boulevard. This should never have taken 13 months or 12 months, and it's going to go on to 13 or 14 months ultimately. According to the city of Austin's database, the signal lights at this intersection were approved for ready for construction in April of 2023. Residents say the signals have been in place for a year now, but they're still not ready, which is an issue for what Kristen Jacobs calls a dangerous intersection. I've lived in the area for 18 years. It has always been a confusing intersection. There have continued to be multiple accidents. According to an email sent March 14th from a city of Austin representative, the signal lights at this intersection will be operational by the end of the month. But according to an email correspondence from just today, a staffing shortage with the contractor might knock the completion off schedule as the city works through contractual alternatives. You got to prioritize this. An intersection like this where there are accidents happening every day, it's got to be made a priority. Burt Green has lived in this neighborhood for 10 years. He says he was happy when he heard a signal light was going up at the intersection. I was delighted because I've got teen drivers and you know, it's a dangerous intersection. It's going to make us all safer. Green says he doesn't let his children drive through this intersection due to how dangerous and confusing it can be. He also doesn't understand why it's taken so long to activate. I've driven up, driven up on three or four accidents that just happened at this intersection. The inability to complete the project has made it even more dangerous. Jacob says if the traffic signals can't be completed soon, a temporary solution needs to be put in place. If they can't get it completed, which to me is unacceptable, but if they can't, ultimately we need something in place in order to make it more, uh, more safe. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.